Hey everybody, Chaos Topia here, and today we're basically are visiting, surprisingly enough, an old field from very long ago that was basically just kind of reinverted to this. Of course, I don't know how. I don't know how basically Era basically said, "All right, this is a, this is good to go," but we're here from it. We got this old stadium back. So this is a this is like the uh, pun old Punisher's field from long ago. Basically, back to in a time that well, right when they were just coming off of their season twelve victory bowl win over the Red Cliff Raiders. So, and for this one, I decided to basically kind of don a Punisher's jersey, well, kind of Punisher's fit. That was I would bet basically with the one that that's on sale. Worked with me. So we're here and well stuff basically d does look like it's a bit normal. It probably is someone up in the stands. But I think I think it's best stuff for this one. It's time to go into the free cam. Just to go and show what I'm gonna what this update's about. Or what? Why is it reverted to, or something like that? So, of course, we have this. Oh, this is someone that he's wearing the season, wearing the season twelve VB uniform of the Punishers number eighty eight. Oh, it's Redo's. Oh, so Redo's is basically kind of going back to his old stomping grounds. It's kind of basically is a bit of nostalgia. OFL's first champions. That's actually fact. They the Avengers are actually the were the first team in OFL history to actually win the Victory Bowl. This one actually makes okay. This one I probably won't be dying at much of this field often. Which is good news. So let's go ahead and go into the uh Locker rooms for some reason, and you, you, yo, okay. So they revert this back all the way, even to like basically to a season 12 locker room. I think these gloves there, I'm not gonna touch them, but yeah, it basically be you come out onto the field if you do the way team. This is based a bit of a fact for you guys. The victor the season twelve victory bowl was actually pretty much of a, a punch when it was the punch the final score was forty two to thirty and this was you know, it was the first victory bowl that Calvin Five actually was in. He was in he was he made to victory bowls twelve and fifteen before making his first one at QB and and pretty much starting up his run, so he actually made it to a victory bowl, and believe it or not, he was the head coach of the Raiders. So, a bit of a fact for you guys there. That and the season and and in season thirteen, the the victory bowl was actually was played in Pemberley. So, huh, a little bit of a double fact for you. So now we're gonna go to the Punisher's locker room, and the punts, they have a lot of good jerseys, bro. Okay, so. Like, they have, they brought back a lot of old stuff. Okay, so if I, like, you put on basically these fits. So, alright, so this is like basically the uh, first, one of the first fits. This is probably like season one-ish when they have these. And then of course, that's their home team, then their way. And then of course, these ones here. Fortunately, the pants are missing. These ones are long gone. I don't know what happened to them. The, the, this one actually is pretty good. These are from. These are probably are some camel ones. I don't know where they are from. I don't know what season. This one. Ooh, nice. This one here. This one here. And this one here. And then you guys will know. Okay, this, not gonna lie. This one actually looks like more of a color rush feel. That and it also and they also had the hands. I think this is where uh 
Hyde's got a lot of this stuff from. Oh, okay. Um, so you have the uh, basically the height build, and then of course the Roxon 2.0 build. I basically you go go ahead and you come out with with pretty much ride out to the stadium. This is actually not gonna lie though. This is actually a nice little update that everyone had he and did. Where did Ritos go? Probably is go ahead and kind of feeling cult nostalgia. But with pretty much this update now being go ahead and implemented, there's pretty much any question question. What's up with this update? Was this is this gonna be was this a, a, a surprise request? Well, believe it or not, I do think there is a reason why to this, and that is basically coming up with a season thirty one head coaches and stuff like that. Because last season, basically, we saw pretty much the Punishers old stadium that was actually not gonna lie, it was a good stadium that was that met like OFL modernity modernity, but doesn't but it didn't feel the same though to to perspective for some people. So I think I believe Era went ahead he got had a coach back of the of the Punishers. So he's gonna be making my head and making his return. So this is kind of what was his old stomping grounds. Another little fact: I do believe he actually was the center for the Punishers back in season twelve. He didn't. He was in game now. Ooh, fast a hair hey era, but he's left. Well. Oh well. It's the old, the old stadium basically back. I guess that's really just the big announcements. Yeah, Era basically, he popped in and kind of showed you all. There's also a lot of other heckles that are planning to retain. Well, aren't c coming in or retaining. Laura Pride was basically the old coach of the Pons. He basically is going to go to Dresden. And there's probably going to be some... People retaining Brent, Caro, Weak Note for some weird reason, Sean, South, JT Uzi, Tecti, Lily, Calvin, Juicy Run, Parker, No Flashes, Gosh, Frankie, Matthew, Moho, Heist, and yeah. Also, there are some rumors that Young Rally is probably head coaching the Sentinels, which, if he does, I probably won't be surprised. But that also leaves some head coaching spots open for the Knights, Panthers, Phoenix, Snowhawks, Jackrabbits, Raiders, Sunbirds, Rams, Warriors, Vikings, for some weird reason. And and Blizzard and also oh yeah and also the Turks so we're seeing a lot of changes. So with that being said, oh, everyone had probably did some updates. That's really just really just it for the for the updates. I do hope that basically this. The stadium that, that air is probably gonna go ahead and go crazy with this, it probably will, but it basically kind of makes basically go crazy, you know. But yeah, that's actually gonna be it for me, so I'm not really much of a talker and really talking about stadiums. 
Anyways, that's going to really be it for me. You basically do like pretty much going ahead and seeing what you guys just watched, I guess. Go ahead and uh, give a thumbs up on the com and leave a comment. I don't know at this point. Anyways, besides that, good boy Chaos Topia, and I'll see you next time. Saddle up. Saddle out. Peace out. Let's go.